Hi parents, I'm Bates. And I'm Molly. Welcome to fifth grade preview night. We're here to ease your mind about the transition from fourth to fifth grade. We know it seems like a big jump, but really it's not hard at all. We visited some of our friends in the fourth grade to find out what questions they might have about the fifth grade experience. So sit back and enjoy while we answer all of their and maybe your questions. What games do students play at recess? During recess, we play basketball, gaga ball, and fireball. When do we get our schedule? You get your schedules on the second day of school. You get one for your binder and one for your locker. I heard we learned how to play instruments in fifth grade. What instruments do we learn how to play? In band, you can play saxophone, trombone, trumpet, clarinet, flute. In the orchestra, you can play cello, bass, viola, and violin. You can also play percussion. What is advisory and when do you see your advisor? We have advisory every morning. We come here to get ready for class and then we come back during study hall. Do we have study hall? If so, how long is it and when do we meet? We have study hall every day for 45 minutes right before lunch. We can study, read, do homework, or go to class. What happens during break? Break is a time where you can go up to the cafeteria and get a snack, and you can go um, talk with your friends, and you can just kind of relax a little bit. How many times a week do you meet at PE, and what do you love most about it? PE meets four times a week, and my favorite thing to do in PE is trash can football with Coach Frost. I'm told you don't need a lock on your locker. Can you tell us why? In middle school, we have an honor code, which is to not lie, cheat, or steal. And if someone else were, were to go in someone else's locker, it would be violating the honor code. What are enrichment classes, and which ones will I have in fifth grade? Enrichment classes are things like specials that you don't take every day. So you will take music, which you use an instrument for, and you will also take CE, PE, art, and Spanish. Does spelling count in your writing class? You have to work really hard in writing class because everything is graded and spelling always counts. What do you love most about being in fifth grade? What I love most about fifth grade is being able to switch between five core and five enrichment classes and having a lot of different teachers. What different classes do you take in fifth grade? Our classes are social studies, science, writing, reading, and math. And we also take enrichment classes. Can you tell us about the unlucky or lucky step that leads down to the fifth grade floor and what the rules are? The rules about the unlucky or lucky step is there are no rules. It only thing about it is that it is a different type of step. I heard that the seating arrangement is different in fifth grade. How is it different? So the seating arrangement in the middle school is much different from the lower school. So you have assigned tables that you sit at every day and it changes throughout the year. What are your three favorite cafeteria foods? My three favorite foods in the cafeteria are sushi, which are usually here on Thursdays, the wine bubbly, and the whole potato chip section. But all the foods in the cafeteria are great. What is the coolest locker decoration you have ever seen? In fifth grade, we're allowed to have cool locker decorations inside and outside. Some people put magnets and wallpapers on their on outside of their lockers, but this person put lights inside of their locker so they can turn flashing and still. Uh, they have cool toys over here in the disco ball. They also have cool cabinets where they can store some cool stuff in there. Who are the fifth grade teachers? This is Miss Ely. She's a social studies teacher, and in her class, you will never stop exploring. This is our amazing science teacher, Miss Barrett. I'm your favorite student, aren't I, Miss Barrett? Of course you are, Chris. This is Miss Walker, our reading teacher in the fifth grade. This is Mr. Solomon. He is the best math teacher in fifth grade. And the only math teacher in fifth grade. What? Hi, I'm Rosa, and I would like to introduce you to Mrs. Tabard, the fifth grade writing teacher. 
We hope we've answered many of your questions. Fifth grade has been great for us. We know your children are going to love it here in the middle school. And you will too. See, See you next year. year.